All right, time for some immersive No Man's Sky action. Actually, I need to get those thrusters taken. I've been watching it get lower and lower for like fucking ever. And now we're out. Okay, so I need that. For right death. Oh, my mining beam is like blue now. I really need to get a new gun. Like the one I yeah. have now is pretty cool, but I'd like to get like an assault rifle. Yeah, me off. too. I was gonna. I was, I'm in the. That's probably the one I'll be in the market for next. I gotta buy a bunch of, build a bunch of shit for it though. Let's just. Oh, let's have a look here. First things first. Get this dihydrogen jelly thing. Be whip. Be whip. Technology recharge. Uh oh, the icon. Oh wait, no, we're good. We're good. We're good. Here, yeah, I'm in a rad fucking killer. Killer. I'm so I love having these creatures. What a what a thing. Ah, there he is, killer. Remember, killer. Ride you into the ride you amongst this planet. Moving fast. Running amongst the planet killer. We'll we will go on such adventures together, my one two legged deer. Oh Okay. That's odd. I was mining copper, and the copper resource I mined just respawned. Crazy. Well, extra copper for me. Like this stuff. Sodium nitrate. Yeah, on this planet, there's those whispering eggs, and they're just like around alone. It's like unguarded, cool. Oh, I think I see one. Let me go investigate. Yeah. If you do like the F thing, you'll see like a red one. Oh, I see it. Yeah. Or oh, do stun things. Oh. They do, but it's smaller and more easy to manage. I'd say, but I don't know if like the yield is as much. Oh no, I lost it. Killer, be cautious. The things all around. Killer, where are you? I don't see. I don't have a visual on them. Oh no, he fell into a cave. It spawned like a fucking shitload from that egg. So maybe it's like it has a percentage chance. Killer should be fine. There we go, we're fine, kill it. Yeah, but yeah, it has like a certain percentage of spawning about different ones. A lifeless planet. I don't know if one a freighter could possibly get one, but.
failed terraform planet, hey? Kill it. Go. Oh, the copper deposits are like insane in this plant. This is this is like a special or or amount. Like there's so much. It's a pretty research-rich planet, I've noticed. The amount of copper I got in one vein here was insane. But you always run out of the copper. Yeah. It's never enough for the <laughs> I'm gonna load this up at the Okatanga. I wonder would be a good where would I wonder would be a good place to look for a different uh, tool. Probably at those stations I'd imagine. Yeah, probably like just exploring different solar systems. Shit, I got a whole shitload of copper that time. A pet, pet, gently pet killer, otherwise he, he'll be starved for attention. I'm not sure what happens when you run out of attention. Also, he's supposed to be wearing his armor plating. There we go. Kill it, let's go. Ben, ding, 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 ding. I should do that one quest of mine that says I'm supposed to go find a colony. I wonder where that 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 might take us to a brand new colony theoretically. Yeah, let's see here. So I got log. Going local register basically going next ones. Okay, that the settlers investigate the planetary settlement. Uh, so the first thing I have to go to. Ooh, it shows. It shows. Settlement hub interface. Taking off. Bzzz.
Okay, let's see. Oh, let's just go like that. Oh, let's go like that. Let's go away like that. The settlement might be on a different planet, but I'm not sure. I can't remember which the other one was. I can't remember what plant this is. Pulsing engine. Oh, it's like a, it's another colony. I can't even remember what plant this is. Let's just go here. Oh, this is a nasty plant. This one. On that toxic plant. Let's see. Coming to overseer to help grow the settlement. Overseer, become an overseer. Invest in settlement. Become a settler overseer. Management granted. Terry Sunland's Chris Escape. How the fuck do you go with settlements? Construct an overseer's office. The overseer's office is the heart of the settlement. The settlement status can be viewed from the blah 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 blah. Okay, so how do you build it? Settlement is in debt. Clear debts to restore production. Cleans hope. Take a look at the settlement. Also, do you take toxic production? If you want to check the settlement out, Brandon, come to my location. It's not on the best planet, but it is neat nonetheless. They do appear to be somewhat procedurally generated because this one looks almost bigger than the Earth. The other one, it has more nice. like, it has different buildings. So I think what it does is it's just procedurally it looks bigger. It looks different, that's for sure. It's totally different. There's a little, like, a server in there. And eventually we'll have a string of, like, all these different colonies everywhere. A little, little restaurant or something.
visit the construction site to begin the assembly. Oh, I see. It's time here. Oh, I had enough silica. Ooh, cool. This is like a generator room. Wow. And I can set up a base in Peter Shrink here, can I? Yeah. I'll do that once that finishes. 46%. There doesn't appear to be any aliens in this settlement though. At least none I've seen. It's, it's an abandoned settlement. Haven't seen a single other character in here. Oh, there's one. Oh, it's one of those Vivex machinist toy. This a yellow star. Where's the sun? Ooh, look at these weird like plants. This is a trippy planet. It it does look toxic, but it's not overly toxic. It's only five degrees. It's a cold, toxic planet with very little living in our fucking settlement here. Oh, the set the overseer's office is almost done. The roof, five metal planning. Oh, I see. You gotta kind of build it piecemeal, don't you? Okay, next to the roof. Luckily, it appears to be a lot of rock in this planet. Such a trippy ass fucking planet this is. Mine within settlement levels. How the fuck am I supposed to get that technology piece then? It's right, there's a technology piece like right by the settlement that says I can't mine it because I'm in the settlement limits. I'm really gonna have to watch this toxic thing. It goes down but fairly slow.
This is a dreary and dank planet. There's dankness everywhere. Get my ship quick to get rid of some of the toxins. Scrub the toxins. Oh, there's a few people now. Some. They're those really mean, grunty type guys, though. The Vivex, I think. Direction office, it says. Back in the blue blazer. There's a way to uncondense carbon. Tons of condensed carbon, but I need carbon. Cool. I think there is. I think there's. Go is it possible if you finer and see what happens? Put it in like the reverse direction or something. Yeah. I think there was. I thought there was. Maybe there's a, a, a one for it, like a D combiner or something. Let's see. We'll try putting. Activated car condensed car. Three microprocessors. Oh, yeah. Nice. Oh yeah, great. Okay, so I'll just do that. Three microprocessors. Wait, I need the uh Shit, where is the actually it's pulsing this guy? There we go. Nope. Space station blast along the horizon. Oh, you can like kind of circle planets, can't you? Processors should be easy about it. shows the locations of two settlements one there and one where somewhere showing one on that other planet colony ship okay well at first let's just look at that one
the Hammer 10 is like fucking crazy plant. <coughs> Quite an ugly planet, but a settlement nonetheless. Have my section set up. My very own things. So do you have to like uh, with the settlements, friend? Do you have to like provide resources for them and shit? You do, yeah. Whenever you build something. I feel like there's more guys around now. There's so very few of those Vivex in this place. This seems like a perfect, uh, a po perfect uh, home for them. Forty nine percent complete. Administration terminal, view construction opportunity. Starship dock begins as a bizarre starship dock. Make settlement decisions. Assemble materials as starship dock. Chromatic metal for the. Oh, cool. Twenty-two citizens happiness. Oh, I see. Sentinel alert level twenty-three percent. All right, Brian, come check out my settlement. I mean, it's probably gonna get forgotten about and pushed off to the side. <laughs> these things, these things happen. Still cool to have. Also, it seems to suggest there's another settlement somewhere in this solar system. The toxic might display. be my settlement. Planetary drone ice key hurrying to large house. Drill warrior ag log. Starship dock. Oh, there it is. There.
Oh shit, there's some kind of creature flying over there. There's a bunch of them. This is gonna be my settlement. I should at least get familiarized with the local fauna, flora. Bombas and Bombayas. Go there, stop by the Okatanga, get some chromatic metal. Need at least 25 chromatic metal here. Oh, I need that. Stash them on that. Take a picture of this. Is this no man's sky change colony picture. No man's colony pick. Yeah, the endless hunt for chromatic metal. <laughs> yeah. That one planet we were on, though, I found, like, a huge patch of copper. I don't know if it's, like, rare, but... It was I know, there's a lot of copper on this planet. That's good for repairing my new ship. That would be a good secret to this, this great, great solar system. Our main solar system. Home to the Okatanga, home to my settlement. I think this is the same as your settlement, isn't it? Yeah. Is it? Yeah, my settlement's in the Okatanga base. <laughs> Our planet? Nice. Oh, yeah. The great Okatanga planet. Oh man, this is going to take an hour to build this starship. A visitor has arrived at your settlement. A visitor has arrived.
Stranger named Citizen Otas is requesting an audience, sales agent of some sort. They offer to sell you plans for an unsolvable turnover farm. Purchases and Otas accept. Give more debt. That's okay. We're at the settlement area. Has enough debt. Might as well add to that. So this is running smoothly. Current building project to complete in 58 minutes. Oversee is free to explore the universe. The administration terminal will alert you when you are required. Also, when you build something it, after you give the resources, it's like an hour you have to wait. Yeah, I built the starship uh, terminal and it's an hour. Yeah, sometimes two hours. I'll have to check on my settlement too. Time to go, gonna go do some exploring. I'm just gonna sell some stuff that goes up of the Tango Tanga. Yeah, I wouldn't mind popping into some new solar systems to check for guns and stuff. Yeah. Theoretically, there'd be higher level stuff, like kind of just scattered. Probably the higher level systems will have higher stuff. We gotta figure out how to get those like iridium drives or cadmium drives and stuff. Yeah. So it's a new citizen dispute. Resolve citizen dispute. Settler Esteen accuses planetary drone rain of running an underground gambling network. find them. Gotta do something about that settlement. Yeah. Sift as well. Okay, you're able to upload a picture of the settlement to your bases once it um, once it does its thing. Yeah, things are looking mighty fine at the old settlement. Oh, sure, sure, call it. Clean's hope doesn't sound very good. Call it World <laughs> Productivity and Happiness Kiss. So let's go call it Glowing Glow River <coughs> Glow Hope. Oh. Close hope. Tyco City. There we go. Tyco City has been made. Alright. We're first gonna just head back to the Okatanga, sell some stuff, and then ready. Let's go let's go to a brand new galaxy. Or in a brand new uh, solar system. We'll go from we could go from where that other place was and then take and yes far off the I'll try moving towards the center of the galaxy yeah i think that's the whole goal well, yeah, man. Okay, you could maybe just, maybe just like stop in like a system get a couple quests do the quest move on to the next system yeah yeah we'll sell sell some stuff
shit. Okay, so what we'll do is I'll just go. S Actually, I can just get rid of this ranted flash. I essentially, don't need any more. Let's quickly feed killer. And we are off. Killer wants some attention. Gently pat him. Give him a treat. And away we go. Okay, yeah. So you wanna do you wanna go from uh, go from the far off land? Go from the far um, off and go from there. Go into. Oh, just wait. I'm range. still repairing my ship a bit. It's almost complete. Cause yeah, we went through that black hole. Let's see. I went through the black hole. That equates to manage your settlement. The settlement status is the central interface. Our administration terminal the status interface so the daily collection serves and versions and additional goods. So Base computer archive, neural simulator, install the neural simulator. Oh, this is like a base mission. Neural simulator. Ooh, that needs a little bit of stuff. for a bit of a carbon run, I think it's condensed carbon and that. Hundred chromatic metal and hundred condensed carbon. That seems condensed carbon. Go on a carbon run. I use the shoot. The first time using the shoot in a long time. The shoot is highly, highly dangerous. Welcome to the Okatanga grasslands. I see, I see Killer is enjoying himself well. Good milestone. Oops.
some reason it's really laggy at the Okatanga grasslands, but I think it's just such a, it's, it's a planet so full of life and shit that it's just like shit everywhere in Okatanga. Okatanga is a, ve a very lively planet. Oh. Wait, these are freighter ships. I think there's a way you can get your own fleet now too. That'd be cool. That'd be cool if we had like a little squadron. Oh, the ship almost landed on Killer. It's fun. the great plains of the Okatanga. Oh, I somehow landed that. That was a blind landing. Oh, I landed like right on the side of the fucking, the side of the monolith of Okatanga. It's like right on the side of it. It's hilarious. Let me bring it over here. I guess I have 200 chromatic metal now. Ooh. Put that that condensed carbon. Let it rip. Basically pointless to put that car carbon back in my thing. There we go, we got tons of condensed carbon. So now let's take and build that stimulator thing. Technology installed. Yeah, objective is complete. The base computer archive. Base computer archive is partially restored. Interact with the base computer to learn more. Bye back. Forty two per cent new data search archives. module a movement module uh, potentially improves increased jetpack to yeah, so I wonder how it works with your suit you must be able to increase your slots in your exosuit hey eh? oh there we go my jetpack is way better my jetpack now is just goes on forever it feels like yeah, there's gotta be exosuit like recovery modules or something. All right, let's prepare and head to the planet. Coming to your location. Blue Bazer's space is hitting the hitting the outer space.
do. <coughs> It'll take a fifty five seconds to get there. Oh. the space station Is it over here oops see you traveling through here. space falling in Yeah, we'll decide to go from there. A minute takes me about a minute to get there. <clears throat> Forty three seconds. Something's happening. Base computer's partially there's the base computer learn more. <coughs> <coughs> One second in the space station. <coughs> Entering the space station in lower bit. So what do I need of? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 chlorine. Yeah, preferably I could get multi-tool that's got like Looks like a piece of shit too. Oops. Multi tool would be my neck my next big one is gonna be multi tool. This one this one looks like just a piece of shit. Yeah, this one's worse than mine. Are there things all over this? Okay, where should we where do you think we should head off from Bren for a new solar system? Um, I just gotta finish my purchasing. Chlorine, they don't sell chlorine here. Okay, so then I need, Shit, I need I have some a of bunch this. Of chromatic metal there. I'm gonna go drop some stuff off the Okatango. I'll be right back. Back at the old Okadanga. Just nine. <laughs> I'll be back. 
So yeah, I think if we if we went from if we went from that remote uh, solar system, we could just like we could just like blast off in the fucking amount of space. See, so that guy's got a shitty ship. What's that ship like? <clears throat> Oh, that's a different one. Look at that one. Mm -hmm. That's yours, eh? Hey? Preparing to sell it. Oh, you're getting a new ship? Yeah. I mean, I already got a new ship, but I'm gonna get another new ship. You could have, like, multiple ones, can't you? Yeah, I have two right now. <laughs> I'm just switching them over. I haven't been able to find anything even remotely as good as the blue blazer, but it looks weird, that's for sure. I wonder if we can customize it. <coughs> oh. Sixteen thousand nanites, Jesus Christ. How do you use this fabricator thing, I wonder? <coughs> the solar based chips are interesting. I wonder if I got any new appearances things. I wonder how you get new appearance stuff.
wonder how you get the different unlocks. Comforting looking one. Go for a back look. Okay, now I switch starships and I sell them in. Or I could try to buy another starship. But I mean, I already have two. Yeah, it's credited. Void Dubula. Guild items. <coughs> I get 4.5 million units for it. Might as well do that. Okay, there we go. We'll get to see a new ship. Is it, oh, is that it over there? It, that's odd. Oh, no, where is it? This ship looks crazy. Oh, it says Apocalyptic Bunny Starship. Oh, there it is. This is my ship. <laughs> that's a new one? Nice. Yeah, paired, partially functional, still needs a bit of repairs. <laughs> Cool. Okay, let's uh, let's see where we can go from from there. So if we go to that, if we go to that, um, do you have a teleporter in that far away world? Um, like when we went one, no. when we went to the black hole. Oh, you didn't put one there. Oh, you have. You should have the space station though, huh? I might. I think here I'll go through there and I'll let you know which one it is. And then let's just pick a random solar system and go from there. I think it's a manage system. Something manage, something other. Hmm. Might be, uh, I'll go to that one for now. The space checking. It's ma man Manchinch Station. Yeah, there's that magma planet. Nice kit. Right. Most certainly. Yeah, let's uh let's pick a solar system to go to from here. Uh 
Yeah, because we're so remote from here, it's like... What we should do is make our way towards that Herber, Herber Herbert's Hamba. What's that symbol? Is that one of our missions? Herber, Herbert's Ham, Hamba. Which oh. one? Oh, we're going which system? Here, let's, uh, let's just see. So we're in the Manage system. I mean, some of these stars might be different indications. Cadmium drive. Yeah, see, I don't know how to get these other drives. I think there are upgrades on our ships. Okay, let's look into that. Because if we could go to a brand new, I mean, that should be a, that's our logical next step for getting somewhere. Oh, you know where we need to probably get it from? Probably need to get it from that fucking, what's it called? That fucking Atlas. Space Anomaly, yeah. Pulling it up now. Bzz, pulling in Space Anomaly. Let's see if we can get cadmium and go down in there. Because there's one right by this system, we can check out what they are. They're probably different types of systems. Oh, this place is so trippy. Yeah, that's what I vote. I vote we try and get the, at least one of those other drives, cadmium. Try and go to that place right next to us. Because one of the ones that is like right next to our, to this current system. Oh, the weird, this place is a place where there are other players tromping around. Whoa, this guy looks crazy as fuck. So many anomalies. <laughs> Everyone, everyone, basically everyone's in like an arm dress that like on me. Uh, okay, so it's in here. Looking into cadmium drive, so craft. Sign a bit. New recipes. Weapon terminal. Oh, there we go. Might have to be one for the old goggle. Let's see Hyperion. Are you able to figure out how to get it? I'm trying to figure oh, that out. Oh, I figured it out. It's it's in the... Oh, and it's, it's not hard at all to buy build. Which one do we want? The Iridium, Cadium, or I think there's a third one. Yeah, well, I got the... The Cadium is the second down from his thing. It's in this... Uh, it's in, like, that um, player bundle. Oh, there we are. Is that you right there? No, that's another person. It's in that, like, uh, whatchamacallit, Atlas base go to the starship guy and he has them i could actually get all of them emerald drive and iridium drive might as well get them those are important red stellar bodies yeah let's do it let's get the cadmium it's only 250 uh thing you gotta buy the blueprint from the starship upgrades guy basically i'm just gonna go back to okatanga and i'll have it in no time Then we'll, then we'll then we'll take a trip down the cadmium lands. Oh, there is a teleporter in the Atlas thing, Bran. There is. The teleporter is like uh, it's just off to the side, and you can go to other people's things from here. That's why they have them. Trippy. Featured space anomaly. I don't know why these are. Interesting. We, you know what? One day, let's check out some of these, some of these other people's stuff at Space Anomaly. I don't know what that was. At any rate, I'm gonna head to Okatango and get this cadmium. <coughs> it's really not hard at all. All we gotta do is get some, 
it's like 250 chromatic metal, so that'll be a little bit, but I have most of that through Katanga. <clears throat> Hundred and forty two. I do have to go on a copper run. Let's just see how much I have in here. Yeah, essentially all I gotta do is go on a copper run and we'll find it. He needs those wiring looms too, but those are easy. Well it looks like we're going on a hunt. Somewhere out in the Okatanga boonies. Should be good. I can ride gold him. That would be crazy. I wonder what the difference is between them. Come on, let's go kill it. Off to get this copper. It just fucking books it everywhere, doesn't it? Do I just go into the anomaly? Like, do I need yeah. a blueprint? Yeah, it's uh, the starship. Uh, starship guy has them. I just got them all because I had a fair amount of nanites anyway, but the other ones have some shit I haven't seen before, so I don't know how difficult it's good those going to be, but at least we can get the cadmium, and then the next one will go to the next place. I'm scared I'm hurting. Ooh! Did I just kill killer? I might have just killed killer by accident. Oh no, there is. Yeah, thank thank goodness the train manipulator I thought killed him right there, but he just disappeared. Killer not helping this situation. Killer, get out of the way. I'm scared. It was traumatic having me zap you into oblivion like that. Probably enough. We'll get another one just to be safe. Starship research. <clears throat>
Yeah, see, we definitely have our work cut out for us for the other ones, but this one, this one's very easy. It's like chromatic metal, and that's basically it. Yeah, how do you even get cadmium? And kill her alone out in the out in the wilderness of the Okatanga. Having these things are sweet. I can't wait till I get to another planet and I see something I really like. It's really easy to tame them. It's like ridiculous easy. At first, I thought it was gonna be a whole process, but it's like all you need is basically 60. Uh, which one call it? Yeah, I think what they did with this game is at one point they were going to try and make it really, really complex and hard, but they're just kind of like succumbed to making it somewhat easier to do stuff. Because I, I seem to think that this game was harder at one point to just to do stuff and get around, and now it's, it just seems like a breeze now. Okay, I should have more than enough copper. Starship, Starship Orange, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the cadmium drive says. 250 chromatic metal, three miring limbs. Easy. Have the chromatic metal. Blast into Okatanga. Okay, cadmium chromatic. Oh, I have enough chromatic metal. I just have the chromatic. Nice. nice. Lost sight of Okatanga base, there it is right there. Where in the flying fuck? There it is. It's crazy how you can like see from space basically like what the what the fucking uh the topography looks like from from space basically. I like the whole terrain you can see from space. We've arrived at Okatanga, just need the mine. Yeah. It's a beautiful early morning in Okatanga. Through these wiring looms, which if I do remember properly, they are fucking expensive. There we go. One, two, three. Oh yeah, you can do that. Oh cool. You can put it in, you just have to install the chromatic mouth. Interesting. We'll go back to Okatanga. Back the old Okatanga.
One of these days I'll not drive has been built. Build up the Okatango one of these days too. Cause I think what you need, I think you do need like kind of like your own main base. The com the communities are nice, but the your main base is like your where you keep everything kind of. Sub bases can be whatever you want them to be, I guess. But the the mainness of one of your bases you get familiar with, you hit it up all the time. You're, you're there, and you can most certainly move them. I would imagine. Condensed carbon, copper. How much of that? Oh, that'll be close. Next time we log, next tomorrow I'll, I'll, I'll work on improving the Okatanga. Cause it, you do like, once you have a main base, you might as well stick it. And I'll decide whether or not I want to keep it Okatanga. Although I do love me a good Okatanga. I guess you can move it to a different place on the planet. Has dihydrogen really close, which is handy. Okay, cadmium drive is done. I'll wait for you in the uh, in the suborbital space up there. Are you in the same? What so? What system are you in? I'm just about to head back to the isolated system. Yeah. Uh, I got that. I got that. Excellent. Okay. Good. The manic station. Matchich station. Matchich, I'll meet you at Mandich system. I wish you could change those ones things. Apparently, for the colonies, you can make a different picture for that, but you have to reach a certain point of it. Get the like, picture with. Managing bases is so cool because it's like you have. It gives you the ability to warp all around the universe wherever the fuck you want. However the fuck you want. I guess it's just one galaxy. One of billions of galaxies. Could there could even be a galaxy out there that is like this? Okay, so let's see. So I'm at the Manchich system. I'll head outside and let's head to the warp to the Cadium land. Okay, so we're headed to. There's one. Yeah, there's that one that's like right next to it. Plus, I wonder if the Google, stars mean. Who goes to the Zebby, is that it? Uh, let's see. There's another one we could warp to, right? Kugas Zebni? Is that the one you're thinking yeah. of? Or... Okay. Looks pretty cool, but I wonder I wonder if the I wonder if the different look of the stars indicates it. Yeah, that's Ambrak Dark Core. Headed there now. Okay, let's head here. Gosner Zebni, tw 12 light years away. It does look different. Does it? Is it I wonder if it's like a different star type. Because as I know I mean, from Space Engine, all the different stars are all different. Yeah, investigating first planet. Airless moon. Oh, yeah, on it. On planet, I'll come to your stick together in this new try get an emerald drive. We just need cadmium. We can go get some cadmium and then build the next drive, too. Nice. Oh, hailing channel is open. Friend, I 
back up broadcast. Trace of metal, respond to your settlers. Going to the moon? Okay, I'm going to the moon. Boo doo boo doo boo boo boo. <coughs> I've arrived. Adium. 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 This moon's interesting, that's for sure. Oh, it's got meteorites! I just saw a meteorite went and blow up over there. I, like, took a chunk out of the land. Cool. Landing. Ooh, this has got whispering eggs here. There you are. Might as well get all the cadmium we can, eh? Might as well. I don't know what else we build with it other than the drive. Yep. Like all resources, I'm sure we'll need more of it. Oh, apparently my settlement is under attack from Sentinels. It's fine. Oh, I had that mission. It's where you get like a little bot. What it happens didn't work if you in don't, multiplayer? Don't do it. It's just, uh, just... Like, oh, you can always get a new settlement, I guess. That planet is a little toxic anyway. How much cadmium do you need? I bet you we could get enough cadmium in no time. 50 for it? We'll maybe go to one more cadmium on this planet. I'll go to another planet and look for cadmium. Yeah, I only got 61 cadmium from that, so. We'll have, to, we'll have to do a bit of a hunt for these. Oh, I see one. A silver deposit, that's rare. That's interesting. Silver sells for her. I mean, with the whispering eggs that exploit, you basically don't even need to worry about credits. I could grind out for a hundred thousand credits easily, or a hundred million, or ten million. This one. Get that cadmium. <clears throat> Oh fuck, I landed right on it and Dumber didn't like that. Holy shit, from this deposit I've gotten like a couple hundred. Found a big one brand new over here, I got even enough. I got 380 from that. Okay, I have now. Nice. <coughs> see how big the one, oh, the one I'm headed to is kind of small. Whatever, we can explore the system a bit more. Might as well get as much as I can of this stuff just in case. Holy shit, look at that cadmium. No harm, no foul, and keeping a bunch of that. <coughs> It might be very valuable. It might, it might be like, yeah, it might be something that's even more valuable than the Whispering Eggs or something. Good. 
Interesting planet, certainly gigantic rock structures are interesting. Look at that planet, it makes you feel so small. I'll head to the next planet. Okay. Oh, indeed. <laughs> Blue blazer is late and left off. <laughs> Our ships got precariously close there. <laughs> that was a little. Okay, so next we can go... What's this unknown planet in front of us? Low atmosphere planet. Oh, interesting. And what else do we got? There's one over here. A scalding planet. That's a new planet. Torrid planet. That's a new type of planet as well. Torrid planet, yeah, interesting. So, what, do you want to go to the low atmosphere one first? Let's try the lot. Yeah, it? let's try that one. It's got cadmium, rusted metal, and magnetized ferrite. It has that as a resource. Crazy. Yeah. Yeah, blast in the location. Bzz. Object of interest. This looks like almost like a giant moon. Entering the atmosphere. Low atmosphere, I bet you when we... I bet you when we get down. It's just like a gigantic moon. Ooh, there's uh, eggs everywhere. There's a lot. There's a gigantic cadmium deposit over there. Magnetized. It has magnetized ferrite. Right? That's interesting. A big whispering egg. Is this just me, or maybe that's just regular size? Plant spooky. Doesn't seem to be any technology or anything here. It's kind of boring, actually. It's very, it's kind of spooky, isn't it? Nothing. Vast nothingness. Vast nothingness. Guess I'll head to the next. <coughs> oh. Bip's got a little close there. <laughs> Do you want to go to the scalding plant? Uh. Planets, this one ahead of us. What's this right in front of us? Is that that moon that we're on? Oh, that's the one we were just on? Okay. Um, yeah, let's give the scalding planet a try. 
Also, I don't, I don't planet. I haven't been able to see. Uh, oh, what is that? This new icon, Bren. Where? Titanium, trintium rich asteroid. I've been there. What do you do? Blow it up. Trintium rich asteroid. Oh, it's, it was just an asteroid with lots of trintium. Kit, want to go to Scalding Plant? <coughs> uh, yeah, where is it? Is it over here? What's on the other side of this planet, eh? It has activated cadmium. It's calling playing activated cadmium, solanium. <coughs> Extreme weather planet detected. Extreme planets have very high hazard levels. Warning, so let's say attack. I really hope my settlement doesn't like blow up and it's like it's fucking destroyed. I, I have faith in them, they can hold it off. It's a quest, and when I did the quest, it like didn't work. And I had to turn off multiplayer <laughs> and restart. <laughs> Classic. Find a nice little island to land off. Beginning suborbital flight. 92 degrees on the surface. Jesus. There's some type of liquid on this planet. I think it's scalding hot water. Oh, firestorm detected. I'm about to jump in. Looks very scalding. Ugh. Crystal sulfide. Water is surprisingly not that hot considering that it was 92 degrees up there. Oh man, look at my my thing falls. My my hazard protection is just like went down so quick. I'll have to wait for that storm to stop. The lightning. <sighs> I, I went outside. My my uh, protection thing came like way off. After wait, basically to add. If you it, just jump in the water, water, it's better. <laughs> <laughs> Classic, oh, extreme weather. These like crab things down here. Crazy, what a crazy plant. Probably get missions before we explore much more. So didium. That's true. You could like do them on the plant. I got some so didium. Yeah, is there a is there a station? There's gotta be a station on this. There's gotta be one. Yeah. Chlorine. Two hundred two hundred and seventy degrees on the surface of the planet. <laughs> Holy Water's shit! Nice As a yeah, a cool, a cool uh, like twenty nine cool degrees in the water. Yeah. The fucking upside out. I flew upwards and it was climbed up to three hundred degrees. It's absolutely scalding out there. Okay, yeah, let's find ourselves the station. Cryto phosphate. 
I'm gonna cry no faucet. Oh shit! It's a geyser. Look out for those. And there's a creature too. I spotted it running around. It's in that I'm cry no frost. Not seeing. Oh shit! There's like jellyfish attacking me. Did you see these jellyfish, man? Yeah, I did. They're crazy. Oh, the firestorm has stopped. Oh no. Yeah. I actually don't see a space station. I don't think this sun does. I was looking around out for it too. Okay, well, I guess on to the next one. What's this one? A horrid planet. But what a scalding planet. Very scalding. What is this? I found something here in space. I don't know what I just got, but I found, I found a metallic plant. Ooh, metallic. High Sentinel has calcium gold. I'm headed to the Torrid planet. Where's this metallic planet? It's right behind them, coming to the Torrid planet. It's not that interesting. I'm gonna go to the metallic planet, I might be able to get more cadmium there. I, I should probably look for what's, what, what's called. So the Torrid planet's no good? I mean, it didn't look that interesting to me. See, I didn't, didn't find any of the resources activated Cadmium on the scalding plant, huh? I'll go look for that. It means going back to that hellscape. That's one of the materials we didn't get. I'll get a bunch of that just in case we need it down the road. Yeah, and there doesn't seem to be a uh, thing at all, huh? A uh, star space station. This is just a yeah, lifeless plant, seeing. a lifeless system. 16 times the power. Sixteen times the power. Alright, so I'm gonna head to a bigger landmass actually. the torrid oh, all those plants and shit on the scalding plant there's how very scalding of them those gigantic bulbs fiberberry this flora phosphorus phosphorus is not sodium the gravity's heavier on the metallic one didn't see didn't quite see any activated cadmium what you activated cadmium is just cadmium put in the fucking condenser thing Spend my time in this hot, brutal planet. All for naught. Just 
floating crystal. Yeah, Grog. Bet you anything that's a fucking. That's all there is to it. Whoa, there's these weird big tubers in the scalding plant. Tubers, hummus sack. Humming sack. Hmm. Grab that phosphorus. Scalding planet is a brutal, vicious planet. Let's just see how. Oh, my thrusters are running out. That's okay. I got lots of dihydrogen jelly. And there shouldn't be much. In fact, let's just build that now. Because being stuck on this fucking planet would be ridiculous as shit. Let's get that phosphorus. Because I don't ever recant having phosphorus before. Morning extreme weather. Yeah, no shit. 90 degrees Celsius. Can you fucking imagine? I mean, that would probably kill us instantly. I got a bunch of phosphorus. I think what we're doing is the good idea, just going around collecting as much as we can from the planets. There's probably so much out there that it's like easy to easy to miss where to find stuff. Really gotta watch my meter with on this level. Oh, far as you can go and it's dark at night in this this fucking planet it's super dark what a crazy planet there's giant tubules that are like massive we didn't even see them Bren on this toward this uh scalding planet how very scalding of it oh I found there's activated tadium deposit bet you anything activated cadmium is just quite literally put in like a minor thing but I'll go grab some just in case. Navigating these fucking places. Uh oh, storm. Firestorm is coming. Oh. There we go, I got activate cam. Goddamn firestorm. Watch how quickly, I bet you it'll just fall so quickly now. Oh shit, look at how far it falls in the first. 160 degrees Celsius, Jesus. Man, it's hot out. I got enough activated cadmium. Plus, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be. It's gonna be like that. I'm getting off this hell rock. I got some good unique materials, but yeah, no more of that. Come to the metal plant.
Oh, crazy! Look at the fucking metal things everywhere. All aboard! This this is a much nicer planet than that fucking other one. Oh, there's ghost guys. Staying out of that with the sentinels. Oh, I got two point sentinel points. I'm leaving. Were you just fighting those sentinels, man? Or? Yeah, I needed the pungium. I'm hiding from them now. Got them sentinels. Can't blast it away from them. There isn't a single thing right in here. Silver deposit. Uh oh. Oh shit. Oh no. I'm under attack. Is there anything else in this system, or shall we head out? I don't know, I'm under attack by hostile forces. Ooh. I don't even know where they came from. Although I have rock at space battles now. I think I'm good to head into the next solar system. Wait, no, I gotta build the thing. I destroyed those fucking things. Oh, dude, can we build that new drive now? Yeah, we need to find a space station. I'm gonna just warp to a nearby solar system. Okay. A normal one, one that will have a space station. Okay. I'll warp back to manage. I'm gonna warp to this misket. Which one? Misket. Gold. If you actually summon the anomaly and then go in it and then go out, you can you can come out in the current system I'm in, I think. Really? I think so, yeah. But it usually says, do you want to go in your current system or... There's... Interesting, I'll just... Oh, wait, there you are. I'm defending a fleet. I'll just teleport to Misket. I got you in there. Bzz. Currently caught in a fleet battle. There's the system. Got an interesting color to this system. I think it's got binary stars too. So I got enough cadmium. Uh, so all I need for this next drive is four wiring rooms. Nice. Four wiring rooms it is. 
one, two, three, four, hundred thirty thousand. Oh, I dipped under five million. Okay, I got my emerald drive. Let's just have a look in space and see what uh, stuff we need. Or see what which ones there are. <coughs> Come in your location. Oh, you docked at the thing? Freighter? Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna buy this freighter though. It doesn't look that cool. Yeah, I wonder what it constitutes. So they, they have classes too, don't they? So we could find it. When we find it, like an A1, we'll grab it. Okay, I'm headed back down and then let's continue. Yeah, I got my emerald drive, so let's just see if there's any closer. Okay, Where is yeah. my ship? Hyperdrive has no fuel. Well, what do you need for the hyperdrive? There it is. You just need some of those wire frames or something. Oh shit. It's not good. A grassy planet. I've never been on a grassy planet before. Is that in this system? Yeah. We'll have to explore this system a bit too. Okay, let's have a look at this grassy planet. And then I want to switch to Warhammer? Warp, warp, yeah, warp. we should probably switch to Warhammer. Actually, we'll explore the grassy planet tomorrow. Just let oh. me build the drive and then let's. Head to Warhammer. Okay. Contaminated plant. <laughs> oh no! Oh shit, I shot at the space station. No wonder I got in trouble. <laughs> I didn't re I didn't realize I was just just playing around. I fucking didn't think that would lead to that. system that does not have chlorine. Fine, let's do some selling. multi to look stupid. It looks like a little pink device. Are we going to entertain the idea of getting that? But I guess we'll look at stop. Oh, it's an A-class thing too. It's a good multi-tool. I'll wait till there's two two ups though. I'll have a bunch of shit to build on it. Anyway. Yeah. Make sure killer is all kept up. Gently pat him. And give him a pillow. Very unfortunate, I can't ride them in here, but it is what it is. That station override thing is. Mm. 
What do these envoys give you, man? I think you can exchange things. I've been looking for a mercenary guild envoy. Oh, this is a cool looking All ship. All I end up finding. This is actually a really cool ship here. It's not a color I like, though. Look at this shit on this on the red rock. How much does this ship cost? Holy shit, it has like a ridiculous amount of cargo space. Mirror of the stars, B class, everything's down. Plus, I would have to rebuild a little shitload. It had like an extra, extra thing. Holy, this is a better one for sure than mine. I can exchange it and get a million off of it. Ooh. I like I've just built all these drives. It's insane for damage potential though. Holy shit. Look at the damage potential on it. it's three hundred and forty seven to mine hundred and twelve. Maneuverability is way higher. Shield strength way higher. Then I'd have to build a whole bunch of shit. Let's see where I have to build that, 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 that. I'd have to build a whole bunch of shit. But wow, this ship is ridiculous, man. Only cost me a million neck, 1.9 million neck here. <sighs> I kinda want one of those like bigger ones. Not red not ready discovered something amazing. part ways with the blue blazer. This is a cool looking ship too. I think I just found like an infinite way to make insane amounts of money. Really? Yeah, I bought a new ship for two point five million and if I scrap it I get five million. <laughs> yeah, into the ship trading deals, hey? Yeah, so that means I get way more back by doing this. Yeah, I just profited three million off of that trade. Nice. Getting all the credits. I like my old suit better. I'm gonna cuss my old guy again. I love the graphical effects in this game, it just looks stellar. Oh, there's another ship I haven't seen before. C class. Damn it. I should I'm one now I'm thinking I should have bought that one ship of that guy's. That's okay. I can always come back to this system because I think it, it probably. Ooh, look at that starship. That starship looks crazy. It always. Uh, I bet you it like depends on different systems. It'd probably give you better random. <sighs> Will bear rewards on certain plants. B class. No man's sky high, sky high. Ooh. Ooh. 
Merchant Opal. Oh shit, it only cost that much. I found a much easier way to make inventory sl slots. <coughs> interesting, interesting, that's good. Cool. No man's sky. 